The collective is on the brink of significant changes and surprises. Major shifts, like relocations or big moves, are imminent. Expect an important phone call or message that will bring clarity or news about something in motion. There's a strong indication of going viral, with your work or presence getting unexpected attention. Politically, this could relate to influential communication or a noteworthy opportunity. Be mindful of potential legal issues or someone feeling trapped. However, there's a protective energy surrounding you, possibly involving financial help from a wealthy individual. Get ready for major developments and keep an eye on opportunities for growth and protection. All right, let's dive right in. We're pulling from this deck. Holy Spirit, give us some clear messages for the collective. What do they need to know? focus on, or change. All right, change is popping up strong. This keeps showing up for someone. You're about to move, maybe even relocate. Big shifts are coming. And here's something else, phone call. Someone's about to get a phone call. Expect communication. Somebody's reaching out with a plan. The blueprint is ready. Something's already in motion, and you're about to hear all about it. Ooh, look at this, viral. Somebody's about to go viral. You have no idea it's coming, but you'll know soon enough. Your phone's gonna blow up. DMs, texts, everything. People you haven't heard from in ages will reach out. Heck, some might even show up at your door. Family, friends, people who know where you live, they'll all want to be a part of it. So, get ready. You're about to get major communication, and it's going to change everything. Whether it's this phone call or the viral moment, something big is about to pop off. All right, let's keep going. More messages for the collective, Holy Spirit. First up, politics. This is interesting, especially because today is Tuesday, and tonight is the presidential debate between Kala and Trump. So, politics is popping up in the energy. Now, this doesn't have to be actual government politics, though. For some of you, it's more like the art of politicking, speaking your truth, sharing your knowledge, maybe standing at your own podium, spitting wisdom, or making moves within a group, a board, or amongst peers. For somebody, the way you see the world, your unique perspective, could be going viral. People are starting to pay attention to your ideas, your thoughts. You might be a leader in your field, sharing opinions that resonate with others. Something you've said or shared is spreading fast. Now, I'm also seeing something about jail. This could be physical jail, but it could also be spiritual or mental. Someone may be feeling trapped, locked down by their own thoughts or energy. If this isn't you, it could be someone close to you, feeling stuck in a situation. But here's the good news, protected is here. Whatever is going on, know that you're covered, guarded, and safe. The energy around you is one of protection. And at the bottom of the deck, we have contract. Something is being finalized, sealed, and secured. Could be a spiritual contract or an agreement in the physical world, but whatever it is, it's happening in your favor. All right, let's dive deeper into this. So we've got contract sitting at the bottom of the deck. That means something important is coming together, collective. It could be a big agreement, a deal, or something that's been in the works for a while. But let's see what else is tied to this. Now, let's clarify this phone call energy. As I was shuffling, I kept seeing your light as being cloaked in darkness. This is a clear sign, someone is being protected. You're not just moving in light, but it's being hidden, covered, shielded from harm. For some of you, this protection could be shielding you from serious trouble, like avoiding a situation that could have led to jail, 
or just a bad setup. What is phone call for the collective? We pulled the three of wands. This means something big is on the horizon. The three of wands is all about waiting, waiting for your ships to come in, waiting for something to arrive. For somebody, you need to hold tight. That phone call you've been expecting? It's on the way. This is a call that's going to bring news, maybe something you've been hoping for, or something that finally brings light to a situation that's been in the dark. You're standing at the edge, watching those ships, ready for this to unfold. Now, let's talk about viral. What is this viral energy for the collective? The Two of Swords came out. That's something you're not seeing yet, an opportunity, a spark that's about to blow up. For somebody, you don't even realize how close you are to going viral. You might be involved in something creative, spiritual, or magical. The Queen of Wands energy is here, full of confidence, charisma, and that black cat energy, which could mean you've got a little mystery, a little magic in what you do. Whatever it is, people are about to notice. You're about to get a ton of attention, and it's going to happen when you least expect it. Something you've been working on, something you've put your heart into, is about to blow up. Keep doing what you're doing, because it's about to take off in a big way. Let's break this down and dig a little deeper, collective. We're asking about politics and why it's showing up in the reading. First off, politics doesn't have to mean actual government stuff. It's more about communication, how people interact, maneuver, and try to influence each other. Think about a politician at the podium, delivering a smooth speech, trying to persuade the crowd. This is what I'm picking up. Somebody is coming your way, and they're going to talk to you like they're running for office, well-spoken, with a plan laid out. They'll try to sell you something, convince you of something, or win you over with their words. The Ace of Cups with the Knight of Wands shows that this conversation is going to be passionate, maybe even emotional, but there's also a sense of urgency. This person's coming in fast, ready to make a point or get something off their chest. Now, let's talk about going to jail. What's this energy about? The Two of Wands and the Ace of Wands came up, showing some planning and movement involved. There's trouble here, someone might be on the road, going somewhere, and that's when trouble hits. This could be someone you know, someone in your circle. They might get caught up in something while traveling, and you could get a phone call about it. Notice how the Two of Wands shows someone holding a phone, looking out into the distance, it's like they're waiting for something to happen. And then, boom, the Ace of Wands brings that action, that spark. This could be a heads up for you to be aware of someone in your energy who might not be sharing everything. Maybe they're planning something risky, or they're on a trip that could lead to some kind of legal trouble. This going to jail energy might also be a metaphor. Someone could be facing consequences for their actions, feeling trapped, or stuck in a situation they can't get out of. It's not just physical jail, it could be emotional or spiritual, where someone's choices have led them to a tough spot, and now they're stuck. Either way, you're going to hear about it soon, and it might come as a surprise. Stay tuned for that phone call, it's going to bring clarity, and maybe even shake things up a bit. Let's break this down, collective. We're asking about protected, and the Six of Pentacles with the Eight of Cups came up. Here's what I'm picking up. Someone you're connected to might end up in a tough situation, like going to jail. Before that happens, they could leave you with something valuable, resources, finances, or even legal help. They want to make sure you or they are taken care of, especially while they're facing these challenges. Think of it like a safety net, something to give you protection or support during a difficult time. For others, this might not even be about jail, it could be about receiving a generous gift. The Six of Pentacles represents balance and giving. 
you might receive something that helps improve your situation. This gift could lift a financial burden or provide resources you didn't even see coming. Either way, it's a blessing that's going to help. Now, let's go deeper into the phone call energy. We've got the Three of Wands and the Page of Cups, which points to communication coming your way. The Page of Cups is about news, something fresh, emotional, and maybe even surprising. You need to be ready, waiting for this call or message. There's something important coming your way, and it's going to change things. It could bring clarity, opportunities, or even solutions to things you've been waiting on. As for Viral, we've got the Two of Swords with Judgment, the Page of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, and Page of Pentacles. This is big energy. For somebody, some kind of news is going to hit hard and spread fast. Judgment represents a big moment, like a final decision or a wake-up call. Something you've been working on, or something you've posted, is about to catch fire. The Page of Swords shows that people are watching closely, and when this news drops, it's going to cause a major reaction. With the Ace of Pentacles and Page of Pentacles, this viral moment might open up new opportunities for you. It's not just attention, it's about growth, prosperity, and possibly a financial breakthrough. This could be something that changes the game for you, a chance to step into the spotlight or make your mark in a bigger way than you expected. Judgment shows that this is divine timing, and it's happening now. Something is being brought to life, and it's going to leave an impact. So get ready, big things are on the horizon. Let's dive into this, collective, starting with the Ace of Cups and politics. The energy around this is interesting. For some of you, I'm picking up on a love offer. The Knight of Cups shows someone is coming forward with feelings, romantic ones. They might even make a bold move online to catch your eye. Picture this, someone posting something strategic, maybe because they think you've got options, or they feel like there's competition. They could be trying to outshine others by doing something big, something noticeable, to grab your attention. They might feel blocked, either literally or emotionally, and now they're trying to break through. This could also mean something about love goes viral, maybe a public gesture, a message, or something unexpected that gets shared widely. It's like someone is making a bold statement, hoping you'll notice. Now, with the Ace of Cups tied to politics, the Queen of Swords comes into play. For someone, this might be a speaking opportunity, a chance to stand up and use your voice. This doesn't have to be literal politics, but it could be related to leadership, advocacy, or something where your words hold power. Think about it, this could even be a contract or an offer to work in a field that you care about. The Queen of Swords brings clarity and intellect, so you'd be using your smarts and sharp communication skills to make an impact. If there's a contract involved, read the fine print carefully. This could be your chance to speak for people who need representation, standing up for those who can't stand up for themselves. It's a big opportunity, so don't overlook it. Let's move to the going to jail energy. We have the Two of Wands and Six of Cups. For someone, this involves someone from your past, maybe an ex. The cards suggest they might be traveling or away from home when they end up in trouble, possibly going to jail. This could happen while they're on the road, far from their usual environment. It's like their past actions or decisions are catching up with them. For someone else, the idea of protected ties in here. Maybe something happened in your past, something that could have led to trouble, but you were protected from facing those consequences. It's almost like a divine shield was placed over you. Here's an example. Maybe you were in a situation that could have gotten you into serious trouble, but somehow, you walked away and skated. That's the kind of protection I'm talking about. You were spared from what could have been a much worse outcome. This energy is layered, but the message is clear. 
Whether it's love, politics, or protection from the past, big things are at play. Stay open to the opportunities and messages coming your way. Let me tell y'all this quick story. It happened so long ago, like years and years back. One of my good friends and I were living it up. Back then, we each had only one kid, and we were always on the move, always traveling. My friend had been in a car accident and got a big payout, so we were just bawling. We'd been best friends since high school, and we did everything together, partying, hitting the road, always looking for the next adventure. One time, we decided to head to Atlanta for a Plies concert. Now, one of our friends worked as an A&R for Big Gates Records, so we had the hookup. We were hyped. But on the way, we got pulled over in a tiny town in Georgia, not far from Atlanta. Long story short, I ended up getting a ticket for weed. I was young and not thinking too much about it. The police officer told me, it's just a ticket. You can call and pay it before the court date, and you won't have to go to court. You're good. I thought, cool, no big deal. But guess what? I never called. I never paid the ticket. I never did anything about it. That was over 10 years ago, probably between 12 to 15 years ago. And you know what? That situation has always stuck with me, in the back of my mind. I'd think to myself, do I have a warrant? Did I ever take care of that? What happened with that ticket? It's something that just lingers, you know? So for somebody out there, you might be dealing with a similar situation, something from your past, something that happened on the road, something you didn't handle. The Six of Cups energy is all about the past coming up. You might be protected from whatever this situation is now, but it's still something that could come back around. Or if this isn't your story, it could be someone from your past, maybe an ex. This person might be facing jail time. That past energy is coming to the surface, so keep an eye out. This story is just a reminder that things from the past can sneak up on you. Let me tell y'all this quick story. It happened so long ago, like years and years back. One of my good friends and I were living it up. Back then, we each had only one kid, and we were always on the move, always traveling. My friend had been in a car accident and got a big payout, so we were just bawling. We'd been best friends since high school, and we did everything together, partying, hitting the road, always looking for the next adventure. One time, we decided to head to Atlanta for a Plies concert. Now, one of our friends worked as an A&R for Big Gates Records, so we had the hookup. We were hyped. But on the way, we got pulled over in a tiny town in Georgia, not far from Atlanta. Long story short, I ended up getting a ticket for weed. I was young and not thinking too much about it. The police officer told me, it's just a ticket. You can call and pay it before the court date, and you won't have to go to court. You're good. I thought, cool, no big deal. But guess what? I never called. I never paid the ticket. I never did anything about it. That was over 10 years ago, probably between 12 to 15 years ago. And you know what? That situation has always stuck with me, in the back of my mind. I think to myself, do I have a warrant? Did I ever take care of that? What happened with that ticket? It's something that just lingers, you know? So for somebody out there, you might be dealing with a similar situation, something from your past, something that happened on the road, something you didn't handle. The Six of Cups energy is all about the past coming up. You might be protected from whatever this situation is now, but it's still something that could come back around. Or if this isn't your story, it could be someone from your past, maybe an ex. 
This person might be facing jail time. That past energy is coming to the surface, so keep an eye out. This story is just a reminder that things from the past can sneak up on you. It's always good to handle them before they handle you. Something big is going viral, and it involves a significant legal decision. The card judication suggests that a major legal matter is in the spotlight, perhaps something that will get a lot of attention. This could mean a court case or a legal ruling that affects many people. When it comes to politics, it hints that someone might make a dramatic move to catch your eye. This could be someone who wants to take your relationship to the next level, making a grand gesture to show their commitment or interest. It might also mean a new work opportunity is on the horizon. Imagine working closely with a politician or influential person. For instance, I once bumped into a well-known politician at a car dealership. He was tall, handsome, and very educated. Even though I'm usually reserved and cautious around new people, I thought it would be amazing to date someone with his profile. If you see courtship and politics together, it could mean you're about to experience important changes or new opportunities in both your personal and professional life. Someone might make a bold move to win you over, or you could find yourself involved in a significant partnership or contract. What is going to jail? Toil and labor with official person. I might take the one off top, official person. This is like, again, this could be like a police officer or a politician. There's some serious stuff happening with a politician or a high-ranking official. Someone in a powerful position is going to jail. This could be someone you know, like a police officer or someone important. If you're dating someone in politics or a high-ranking job, they might be the one facing trouble. When it comes to protection, a wealthy person is involved. This means someone with a lot of money is stepping in to help you. They might be using their resources to keep you safe or cover some legal issues. Expect to hear from this person soon. They might call you or give you some important news.